international show. You're probably thinking what the oldest sport international show is. Well, here's an interesting voiceover from myself. Tell you. Thank you, Sean. January isn't the greatest of months for us car lovers. The days are still too short, the weather is cold, and those roads are pretty salty. However, all is not lost since 1991. Autosport International has become the place to catch up with all things going on in motorsport. And I do mean all. With the event split into four key areas, the racing car show, engineering show, performance and tuning car show, and the live action arena, there is so much to look at for any enthusiast including some absolutely mental hardware like this racing tractor with a Merlin engine and a boat so right now we're just waiting in a queue to get into the live action arena the queue looked far worse than what it was moments later we were moving into this huge arena to watch some absolutely class cars hooning around including some awesome motocross bikes Formula One driver Charles Leclerc. Um, it did in a way because I did definitely not expect to see. And other various grassroots race cars. There's plenty of things to purchase for the home, for the kids, and even for the big kids, with lots of modifications on offer in in-car entertainment, suspension, and alloys too. So make sure you bring enough money with you. But wait, where are all the Porsches? Of course I've got Porsches, but I'll be honest with you, there wasn't many at the event, which was a bit of a letdown. Porsche had a great stand, showcasing the GT4 Club Sport Racer, as well as a road going GT4. And also their 991 Carrera Cup Racer. this wonderful teamhard.com cup car KW's GT4 looked amazing plush with their crazy 991 GTS on air this wicked 964 and Raj's timeless 964 on airlift suspension and rotiform wheels That's one of the great things about the performance show here and Autosport International as well. You get to see some wicked modified motors. The prices range, uh, £37 for a day ticket for an adult, uh, concessions a bit cheaper for kids and more I'll say is it's definitely worth it when you consider um, what you get for your money. And as a family day out, perfect. You've got great food choices here, Starbucks, Subway, 
people by the spoons if you want to drown your sorrows after spending X amount of money on parts. We'll run 11 rating for this, I'll give it a very strong 9 out of 10. Great way to open up the show season. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe to Run 11. Click that button now. Why haven't you clicked the button yet?